Hi, I'm Vijay Sinha. Hi, I'm Suresh Srinivasan, known as Side Skunk Works. And we're going to be talking about how we created the cosplay for Harbor, Garland's badass new Indian agent. I've been cosplaying uh, on and off since 2013. I love video games. I grew up with video games. That's always been like very close and personal to me. I started cosplaying around 2013, the same time as Vijay's. And 2017 onwards, I've been doing cosplay full time, which is making props, doing cosplay events. Uh, basically, that's my line of work now. I would never have thought Riot would want to make uh, an Indian agent and also ha have a cosplay created for that, uh, you know, in India. My first natural reaction was, holy sh**. <laughs> it's finally <Yeah>. happened! <laughs> I think for me it was mostly nervous energy because Valorant is a very popular game and it is quite popular in India as well. So we got this, but do we got this? We got this. <laughs> <laughs> we are basically a team of four. Vijay who was handling most of the communications and I was trying to coordinate, get the materials, coordinate with the cosplayers and also build the props. Dr. Shireen was the one who did most of the sewing work, which is for the the shirt awesome. and the pant. And uh, Tanya, who also happens to be a veterinarian full-time. So Dr. Tanya. So we had a lot of very qualified people on this project. <laughs> yeah, so we essentially had our cosplay squad, but we were still one key thing that was really important to this that was kind of missing. And that was the person who we were making the cosplay for, because it wasn't for us. <laughs> we were making this cosplay for Ankit. Launching an Indian agent, specifically Harbor, the feeling was amazing because everyone uh, wanted uh, an Indian agent which you know we could play and you know uh, enjoy. And luckily, I got the opportunity to cosplay Harbor, so that was like uh, it meant the world to me. Harbor, personally, I feel has a very uh, soldier kind of a vibe, very raw. Also, uh, he's very stylish, like a Bollywood actor. So it has that personal touch which we all Indians love. When I looked at the character the first time, the first impression that I get when I saw Ditsy was like, yeah, this looks like an Indian guy who could be in Valorant. So he's basically Rich. using the element of water and it's blues and greens put together. It was kind of like a very interesting thought process when you look at the uh, like the color scheme, especially for me, that popped it out. He's like broad, he's strong, he's just like Angad ka pair kind of feel, immediately kind of strikes. And he's got that dark, powerful features. Just looking at certain of the details, I love how it would look in the game. I loved the possibilities of how how it would look in cosplay. I have never, you know, cosplayed at this level. The scale is huge. And I've seen that in the preparation from the beginning. Every detailing of the cosplay has been uh, checked again and again. We didn't want to compromise on this cosplay. So things like, how did we want to scale the collar? Correct. How do we want to scale the armor? Correct. If we scale the armor in a wrong way, then would it, uh, yeah, we have to exactly. account for his movement in exactly. the cosplay. It seems like it's a simple process, right? You think it's just a shirt and a pant. It's not. It's a lot of small, 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 small aspects, which is, trying to understand how they had layered the different aspects of the shirt itself. Yeah. There are highlights on it. There's like yellow stripes that go across. It has to fit proportionally to him as per the main character. The collar in the concept we saw looked yeah. asymmetrical. Yes. So we thought to ourselves, oh, so we, then we just like uh, shape that in a yeah. way, use like EVA form yeah. or whatever to shape it. But no, it's actually symmetrical. Yes. It's just folded in it's that way. Folded that way. like, ah, okay. So then how do we do that <laughs> without cutting it symmetrically? Yeah. So it was challenging to say the least. Yeah. And the, and the solution we'll give it out right now is basically you put a metal put wire a wire inside the collar. Just so. put a wire. Uh, secondly, the pants. On the surface, it will just look like simple pants. But then when you look at it, like there are stitch lines that run along the center line. Yeah. There is an interesting number pattern at the back and then there's knee pads which is obviously something very tactical so we kind of custom made the knee pads made them to the color as per the reference sketches given to us then moving on to the pants above the knee which was actually the most toughest part it has a series of folds and I am not kidding, we actually tried it three times before we got it right. Even if you get the, the spacing right, one side, the spacing goes off on the next side. You get both the spacings right, you put it on the pant and you put the pant together, it goes up and down. And then you're like, okay, fine, take it apart, let's do it again. The boots, once we got them to his size, was relatively yeah. simple because we just added on a little bit of EVA foam, which is kind of the material that most cosplayers work with. Just added a little bit of highlights, added the paint to the blue color. You see all the bits and pieces, but when it actually starts coming together, it's like, holy sh See, Ankit just put on the cosplay. Again, it just felt like this kind of like, you don't realize it until you think to yourself, like, we made this for him. Yeah. And he's putting it on and he looks great. And when we saw Ankit in his Harbor cosplay, we knew it. That is a Raja. The moment I saw myself with the entire costume, uh, wig and uh, moustache and beard, I was like, oh my God, I look so 
amazing. <laughs> also the bike, it was so stylish. I was happy that you know I got to sit on the bike and you know I had to give some poses. The entire experience has been amazing. I'm glad that you know I got to cosplay Harbor and no one else did at least in the beginning. My humble request to Riot, please give me the bike please. I am your Harbor, please. When we first put the beard on Ankit, yeah. He said something which kind of would would be very apt when we put everything together. He said apna time aayega. <laughs> I think apna time aaya hai. <laughs> so, I think that is that is what it felt like, you know. We are here. We are uh, here. Yeah. We got an Indian agent in Valorant. Yeah. Uh we got Harbor in Valorant. And we hope everybody as, thinks as this as is as cool as we think it is. Yes. Yes, that is true. <laughs>